Well, everybody, there's some bad news today. <laughs> some terrible, terrible news, especially if you play GeoGancer for free. Announced today, GeoGancer is removing the option to play for free. They've had their option of free play for 10 years in their post. They even said so. Proudly said so, it appears like. Um, I'll, I'll just go ahead and read it out here. For over 10 years, GeoGuessr players have had the opportunity to play the game for free. We have decided to no longer offer the possibility starting February 1st, 2024. No challenges, quizzes, and joining parties will still be free. Um, but even, even with that, even with that, they're getting rid of... <sighs> Oh my God! Getting rid of free play is, I think, is a death knell for 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 GeoGuessr. Already, so many people have been so upset by what they're doing with the website, the UI changes, the focusing on things that um, people don't necessarily want them to focus on. It's just very upsetting. It's very very upsetting. I I had a great I had a great sleep last night, and I woke up first thing. I opened up Twitter or X, excuse me. And I saw this. Bam. There you go. All right. Cool. Well, I pay. And I'm still upset about this because we'll go into detail about that. They're raising the prices. <laughs> For those that, that, that want to stick around, they're not only are they, they forcing free players to pay, they're also raising the prices. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. I, I've gone through a lot of these comments here. And a lot of... There's so many people that are just simply upset. They're angry. They're sad. They're mad about it. A lot of them are saying that, um, you know, they wouldn't, they, they only play, you know, every now and then they, they, they don't, uh, they, they wouldn't have even started playing GeoGuessr if it wasn't for the, the free to play stuff that they were able to do. It's just like, this is going to cut off such a huge of player base for them. This is, this is, this is the worst decision they've could, they've could have done. Honestly, this is, this honestly is the worst. So here's the full statement. Go pro to continue playing GeoGuessr. For over 10 years, GeoGuessr players have had the opportunity to play the game for free. We have decided to no longer offer the possibility starting February 1st, 2024. Therefore, all existing players with a free account will need to sign up for a GeoGuessr Pro subscription to continue playing the game. Playing challenges, quizzes, and any game mode within a party invited by a pro member will, however, continue to be free. Furthermore, the price of all new pro subscriptions will be adjusted starting the same date, February 1st, 2024. If you want to take part of the current offer, visit geoguessercom slash pro. The plan price adjustments are depending dependent on your currency. As an example, the, the subscription plan Pro Unlimited will be adjusted from US $199 a month to US $299 for a yearly subscription. Please note the price for all pro subscriptions purchased before February 1st, 2024 has not been changed. We haven't made any significant price adjustments to our subscription offering since it was introduced back in 2019. Despite high inflation and increased costs such as hosting, these updates will allow us to invest more in the game. It will make it possible for us to deliver more value to our players, adding more awesome features, amazing content, and improving the game we love. We are also ramping up investments in the competitive scene. The upcoming World Cup 2024 is a pivotal moment in this journey we are committed to building the best geography game possible and look forward to showing you what we have in store speaking of store look at this they still have that microtransaction shop up here why don't you go when you go invest more in the microtransactions guys don't you want to buy a moonwalk for three dollars guys don't you want that cool little animation that animation that, 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 that animation three dollars three dollars that animation is three dollars i can go on to steam right now and buy tons of games for three dollars Okay, I'm, I am fine with there being a microtransaction cash shop as long as the game is free. Now the game is no longer free. It is a forced subscription if you want to play the game, and yet they're still keeping the microtransaction cash shop. I've lost, I've lost, <laughs> I've lost the, the thing there. <laughs> I don't know. I sure they have a point about it not being updated price wise since 2019, but what is there that is worth being updated? Sure. They're doing a heavy focus on, on the multiplayer side of stuff. Sure. 
they, they want to do the World Cup stuff. But, <laughs> like, what is what exactly is the percentage of people that, that do that rather than just play the game? Right, like what? What's what's the they they want to invest so much into making GeoGuessr an esport? It's so counterintuitive in, 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 intuitive to what GeoGuessr is in general. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm just upset because I'm not a multiplayer guy. I don't play multiplayer, as you can see. If we go to my profile here, I I don't play multiplayer. I I, I solely play it just to enjoy the game. And <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know, man. It's, it's super upsetting. It's very, very upsetting. It, 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 just, it just feels like they keep doing things that I hate. So at this point, I'm debating even, even staying a, 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 a subscriber anymore. Like, they keep changing the UI, they make the UI ugly, they make the UI just more mobile game-esque feeling. They added the microtransaction shop, which I never liked, but, you know, I don't have to do, I don't have to deal with that, but they still have it, even though the game is now a pay-to-play pay game. They, they got, they, they switched everything to these avatars, it's so, it's so annoying. It's so annoying. I know, I know. I, I, I am emotional. I am upset. I am emotional. I am irrational right now. I fully understand that. But I feel like it's okay to be upset when things like this change. We can go back through and read a few options. Um, cancel my subscription because of this. Goodbye. Oh, not options. Comments. Uh, moving to Geotastic. Yes, guys. If you still want to play a free GeoGuessr-esque game, Geotastic is what you want to go and take a look at. It's awesome. It's pretty cool. Uh, you can play a lot of different game modes. They have multiplayer. It is a crowdfunded, ad-based Geoguessr alternative. I say it's pretty cool. And to be honest with you, oh look, they have a World League as well. <laughs> to be honest with you, um, if you just go, we can watch an ad. Uh, if you just go in and play a game, the the UI is so much better. It, it's it's just infinitely infinitely better. And look at the map. Look at the map here. The map is amazing because we can switch between the we can we can like toggle roads or, or the mountain view. This is great. They have so many better options. So yeah, geo uh, geotastic I think is you know it, it's going to see a huge bump in in player base now that GeoGas is going is is taking away their free option. I just, I'm just upset. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I, sure, I can still play, but I know for a fact there's tons of people that that play for free. Um, I, I, here I am complaining a little bit too much. Uh, at Geotastic Games, I see you getting a huge wave of new players soon. Are you still keeping microtransactions paid game with microtransactions is pretty scummy. I've subscribed since the day you launched the subscription thing, but I didn't don't think this is the right move. If there's no other way of maintaining the game, just say so. That's okay. Your work hosting the services uh, aren't free, uh, but don't sell it with these updates will allow us to invest more in the game. If that's the real and only reason you can still keep a portion of the game free, specifically for new players. Let's be honest. How many new players are willing to pay for the game without even trying it? Content creators are important. I get it. I stream GeoGuessr almost every day. Shout out to Xavier Sanchez. Uh, I get it. I stream GeoGuessr almost every day. And my viewers love it. But it's not the same as actually playing the game. Not even given the opportunity to play it for a while doesn't seem like a smart decision for the game of this style. It is If it's financially viable, I think you should reconsider this change. I think they should as well. Uh... I love you, but I think this is a huge mistake. One of the strongest aspects of GeoGuessr is, is its accessibility, and there are many other ways to monetize the game without creating an artificial entry barrier for potential new players. And the thing with that is free to play as well. Um, it's it's not like you know you had free reigns to the entire game. It was like oh you can play for five minutes and then you have to wait ten minutes. You can play for five minutes and then you have to wait ten minutes. Play for five minutes you have to wait. It's already super limited. What what's wrong with that? You give it's like a just give it to them like it's a demo or something. Since everyone is paying for this awesome game you gave us, can you give us ranked team duels, please? <laughs> no, oh, I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry. Not gonna lie, I don't think I would have bothered playing it initially if I hadn't been free to do so. I feel like you'll lose a lot of potential new players from this. I think they will. Congratulations, you killed your game. Do you have an educator subscription? Oh, yeah, we hear he's talking about how um, he encourages his kids to play GeoGuessr, <laughs> but now he can't because everything's behind a paywall. So it's like, hey, kids, go and buy this thing. <laughs> When before, the kids could have played it for free. I've been playing Jugesa for a while. However, I never would have started playing if I didn't try it free first. I think this is a mistake. Sir, this is the 19th of January, not the 1st of April. Corpo is going to be Corpo. The past two years, this game has gone fully downhill and has been sad to see. I agree. The UI changes in general. The UI changes, the font changes, the weird animation thing, the whole mobile game-esque um, like direction they're going with it. I, I, I'm not a big fan. That's an L, and you know it, gigantic L. You know this as well. Firstly, we have to wait for 10 minutes just to play for another 5 minutes, and now we have to play. Uh, now we have to pay. Sorry, but that's an L. In my country, Indonesia, this game is getting more popularity. I create GeoGuessr content. Shout out to Chiku. On TikTok, and it's going viral. People are curious and start to play. Most are students who don't have income yet, and by doing this, I think it will disappoint them. Doing esports and closing this access to beginners, meh. Yeah, it's... <laughs> I, I just have a different mindset. I, I understand they want to really focus on their World Cup esports stuff, yada, yada, yada. But <laughs> I, I just don't think it's the right type of game to be like super, super invested hardcore into esports. You see how esports kills all these other games. Uh, Overwatch was killed because of esports. Um, you don't see anything like that. I think Call of Duty is being killed because the 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 incentive on esports and pro players it, it takes the right game for it to be an esports game for it to be successful. And I don't I don't think GeoGuessr is an esports game. <laughs> I, I really I really really don't. <sighs> wow, this is a terrible idea and is demotivating me for me to play as I know that now it will be even more difficult to attract new players. Greatest money grab attempt of all time. Huge L. Free to play is restricting enough as it is. The paid privileges, especially with how you've increased the price of them, aren't worth enough for the most casual players to choose GeoGuessr over other alternatives. Going from a massive W, no move duels, to the biggest freaking L in the world. Genuinely sad and disappointing. Can we just pay like 20 euro once and then have it forever like every normal freaking game? Yes, that would be nice. Well, that's the, uh, well, that's me never playing again. Then shame as I enjoy it, but I should be a, it should be a free to play game. Uh, incredibly disappointing. Why though? I only started playing the game because I could play it for free. Once I discovered and I liked it, I subscribed to unlock all the features. I doubt that many more will join without the restriction restricted free to play option. Sad. Man, what? I am a subscriber, but I hope you calculated well what this will cost you in a new players, because I know for a fact that many people would never have tried this game if it was behind a paywall. I agree. This is a huge L. Nevertheless, I love the game and rooting for you to succeed. I hope you know what you're doing. Well, let's hope. Bad decision. Biggest L. 11 out of 10 GeoGuessr updates are bad. Congrats. <laughs> Uh, yikes biggest l ever seen nope big mistake l l l brave and also very logical decision very logical are you just trying to get the uh the impression clicks or maybe he thinks this is a good idea brand and product designer freelance map art good monday okay give at least a trial period for i don't know one day or five games they, it was already a trial period that's the thing the free to play was the trial period but now they're not even giving the trial out. Big L. <laughs> Best update in recent years. Well, guess GeoGuessr's dead now. Man, are you actually serious, lads? Come on, terrible idea. I think this is great, and unlike most people, I don't think the price is high at all. I do think that if a free 30-day trial or something would be a good way to introduce new players now that they can... Get... You don't need a free 30-day trial if the, the free-to-play was already so limited. You don't need a 30-day trial. <sighs> this is what kills your game. Rare GeoGuessr L. Please revert this. We got the office memes. This sucks. L. Boo. Huge L. Massive GeoGuessr L. It, you get the idea. Most people absolutely hate this. Most And it is a bad idea because you're going to cut the player base 
by a huge portion. I imagine a lot of people, a lot, a lot, a lot of people only play this free to play. They could have done other ways to monetize it. They could have had an option where, much like Geotastic, if it is free, you get ads. Why not? They have the cash shop. If if they if if they want that, why don't they? I don't know. Put more things in the cash shop worth buying, and uh, give an incentive of like, oh, you're a pro subscriber. Here's you know some free stuff. They could have done a battle pass. Even a battle pass, I think, would have been a better idea than getting rid of the free to play option. Why didn't they do a battle pass? Every game has a battle pass. I don't like battle passes, but I still think. A battle pass would have been a better option. I don't know. <laughs> I'm unreasonably upset. I'm sure. I'm sure. I. It, it, it's. I'm sure I am. It just sucks, man. It really sucks. It really, really, really sucks. Sorry for ranting for so long. I apologize about that. <laughs> I really do. Uh, go check out Geotastic. Um, I'm going to keep my pro subscription for a little bit longer. I mean, I'm still going to play the India GeoGuessr, but I think I'm definitely going to look into Geotastic and other alternatives going forward because it, it, it feels like every update, I'm, there's something about GeoGuessr that I, I dislike, and it just feels like it keeps going down the, a road that I don't like at all. And uh, yeah, I think it might be time for, for me to switch it up to an alternative, but I don't know yet. Anyways, thank you for watching, guys. Hope you had a good one. Take care. Goodbye.